Hi guys, it's a beautiful day once again and welcome back to Dexter's World Channel. I feel the moral obligation to inspire my co hobbyists here in our community. Over the past years, and even during the pandemic, I've been the source of their inspiration about this fish keeping, and I help them a lot in the disposal of their produce. And I received a call from one of my friends, and you know him, he's Panoy, the known goldfish and even this betta fish breeder here in our community. He needs some help, and we're gonna go to his place, and we will see how we can help him. This big bike is really big, actually big for me. Look at the sound. So this is gonna be an exciting trip for us. And we will be traveling more than seven kilometers away from here. So come on, let's go! So this is an exciting trip, my friends! It's my joy to visit the fish farms of our friends here and I will surprise them with my visit today. See, a monkey. I enjoy this big bag a lot. It's easy to handle if you have this confidence to drive this bike. Dexter's world! Go! <laughs> we are dropping by here and we will get some, you know, gas. Actually, I'm really very also concerned about the rising up of this, uh, this fuel because uh, per liter here it costs us around 100 pesos. That's two dollars. And we're gonna see if how much we can buy out of this 500. Bandit ako ba? Diesel? See, so we've got this almost 7 liters of gas and I think it's gonna be enough for our trip today so we will proceed
So finally, we are here at the house of my my friend Neil. And you know him, actually. He's been my partner in business for quite some time already. He's been my supplier of this betta fish. And in this community, I have so many friends, actually. And you will see here that he's upgrading the quality of his betta. What is this line? Super red. This is super red betta. And you will see that they're already jarred. <laughs> Oh, this is a good strain of betta because aside from it has dark color, it will develop a long tail. So how many pieces do you have here? We have how many? One, two, three, more than 50, 50. I think. So 50. Wow, so aside from the super red, we have also the super black. And you have the platinum. The platinum betta. This is amazing. And this man is really very talented in so far as fish keeping is concerned and I've been encouraging them to continue on with this passion in order for us to also keep the spirit burning deep inside about this business of fish racing. Okay. He said that he's back to beta breeding because pandemic is all is over actually we really had this you know difficulty of selling our fish during the pandemic we should get by no we should how many breeds or strains of beta do you have here four four, four strains you have four strains platinum. the platinum platinum dumbo black orchid and super. the super red and galaxy koi oh Galaxy Koi Beta is just very cheap. <laughs> this is the male. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and these are your breeders. Wow. He's doing good with this business. Though during the pandemic, we really had experienced bad, uh, you know, uh, situation here because we cannot sell our produce and we cannot go to places where we can get the food, the dapnya, because uh, it's really, it's really hard. And the uh, wife is here. <laughs> Abigail is here. And Audrey, what's Aud where's Audrey? So, been trying to help these guys. And, uh, well, Neil can, can testify that every time that he needs my help, I, I will always be here for, for him. So, we will buy uh, worth 500 pesos and then we will sell this to our pet store. So guys, you will see the common tank actually of this Super Red Beta and Neil is sharing with us the experiences about you know fish keeping and uh, it's more better than employing in some other endeavors like the establishments and he shared to us that this is good why because you don't have any boss you are the boss and the master of yourself and you will see that there are many here you know where did you get your your strain uh, i mean the parent stock of this where did you get the uh, Reynan, Sungpang, shout out, yeah, from the bow, and uh, out of one pair only, he was able to produce this much, and you will see that it's now growing and it's about to be jarred and be released in the market. So those of you who are just here, uh, how much will you sell this one? You just, you can just, you know, PM, <laughs> yes, send a private message to Neil, and you can transact with him the price of this but for me i will get some how many pairs for uh worth 500 pesos and and uh, this is the encouragement that we can give to our fellow fish keepers to breed a lot and then i will help them marketing their produce so we're here in the house of my friends renald panoy and neil is here 
and uh, these are my co hobbyists We've been helping with each other, and you will see that they already have extended their facility. Imaningi extend no? Anald, imaninald. And then over here, they're making some renovations, and there, so. Kumusta ang business? Okay lang. Okay ra business. Mas mayo pa ni kontra sa magunsa pa mga mga empleyado. Ikaw na mangga sa sa pagka mag na mangga sa PNP siguro. Reservist. Reservist. Yeah. So these are just uh, you know extra income as service. Panoy is duty making duty as uh, security. security guard in uh, one of the universities here. And aside from their main you know um, career they also have this uh, sideline uh, fish keeping like what I have said I feel morally obligated to also visit my friends and ask for the predicaments or maybe the success stories to encourage each other so my kid So I got this pearl scale and this aranda. Actually, we normally have this practice of exchanging our materials in order to upgrade our materials and to prevent inbreeding. And you will see that Panoy here has uh, so many also of this goldfish. And we're not in competition, but we are actually uh, doing this in order to have some you know referrals or if he has some experiences about this sickness or whatever kind of disease that may be experienced we've been sharing what medicine and what particular approach that will cure and this is actually the the spirit of camaraderie and the spirit of friendship that we don't being threatened by each other but we feel that in cooperation and in constant sharing we're gonna be able to succeed and be able to sell our product to the market so Panoy is here and you will see the pearl scale he has produced so plenty. I'm helping him out disposing all this to the market. So that's all that we can share with you so far. I hope you will continue to like and share our videos and we're doing this video in order to also show you the actual scenario and situation of the fish hobbyists here in our community and it's my desire to really keep the spirit of this business and sharing our ups and downs bad and good practices and uh, I hope that you will become interested about this and I would like to make a shout out to our new members to the channel to the followers and even to the new subscribers thanks a lot and we are doing you know videos every other day that's why we really strive it very hard and do such great effort just to be able to realize our dream which is to make blog every other day and i would like to see you in my next video only here at dexter's world